Hi, today I'm going to discuss nutrients for eye health. And before I can go into the details of nutrients for eye, and I just want to show you one statistic. In the world today, there are more than 300 million people who have some kind of vision impairment. And among the 300 million, 40 million of them are complete blind. And this is really alarm statistics. What the even more alarm is that most of the brand or vision impairment can be prevented by simple use proper nutrition and to maintain your eye health. So that's why why that nutrition for eye health is very very important. Um, because the, the eye is really very spe spe special organ and they need specific nutrition to maintain the function. And here's the eye. This that's just kind of a section. And uh, here is the front. And only this part is expo exposed to outside. And it's, uh, this is cor cornea. And after the cornea, the, here's the pupil. And so around the pupil, there's a lens. And inside this eye socket, this filled with this uh, semi-liquid, liquid, uh, jelly-like jelly substance. And so in the end of this uh, eye, this uh, retinal, this is uh, contains most important function to transfer this uh, light into an electronic parcel and this single of them transfers through the optic nerve to the brain. So the, in the normal situation our eye function by you see something in front like the light and or subject and so this light goes through this uh, eyes, cornea, and goes through pupil. And because everything in the eyes transpa transparent, and so when light reach this retinal, and they have some kind of reaction with photoreceptor cells, and that photoreceptor to transfer the light into an electronic parcel and that kind of information and since that light and the optic nerve cannot uh, accept this uh, light but, can, but only can and uh, transfer the uh, electronic parcel through the nerve to the brain so then you can visualize the scenes from your UCUI and that is the here why this uh, nutrition is important for this uh, eye health because uh, the eye need really some kind of specific nutrition and only specific eye. So that's why most people uh, don't know this simple knowledge. For, for example, in the retinal, you need vitamin A. And, and also omega-3 fat acid. And that's important. Both compound is very important for the photo, photoreceptor. So, because the photoreceptor to transfer this light into the electronic parcel in order for this part, this single transfer to the optic nerve. So, you need a lot of vitamin A and omega. And, and the mercury is the is the most sensitive part to receive the information 
um, from outside your eyes. And in this macula, this very important, two very, very important components. And that, of course, these two components, lutein and the axin, also need in retinal, all the retinal, but in this area, macula, is, it is especially important. And without sufficient lutein and then axin, and you can create some malfunction of the eye. Uh, another example of nutrients is vitamin C, vitamin E, and zinc. And we, we know that the eyes is subject is expo basically exposed to outside to the environment. So need this not for ox not of oxygen and uh, to damage to the eye tissues. You need vitamin C, vitamin E and zinc have anti and oxygen activity to protect eye function. And zinc is very well, especially important. Um, it's important part for the eye uh, reaction. So, so that a number of diseases uh, associated with uh, nutrition. For for example, diabetes ret retinopath, and this is a disease usually. In the patient with diabetes, and that's the reason. If you have diabetes, you need to check your check your eye very very regularly because in the diabetes patient, because you have high level of sugar, that's what cause damage to the blood vessel in the retinal, and that cause malfunction of blood vessel that cause diabetes retinal pass. And that will cause uh, your problem to your eyes. And another disease, uh, in most cases, age related disease is macular degeneration. And that, in this point, as mentioned, this one point is the most sensitive uh, point. So here you need a lot of routine and the axin. So because these two product is reduced, it will cause macular degeneration. And the cataracts, and because that's associated also with the nutrition in eyes and result damage of the eye tissue cause clouding of of the eye so and glaucoma is also degenerative diseases because main causes due to the airness in the eye to cause high pressure and gradually result in damage of optic nerve optic nerve and cause glaucoma. Of course, nutrition is very important for the for for the eye moisture because in the eye the several gland, and if the nutrition is not enough, and the gland will cannot secrete enough solution and keep your eye moisture. So, this just show example that all these disease diseases is have some kind of relationship to this uh, nutrition of of you take but so, because it's, you can see that this is most of this nutrition is actually specific for eye so you need so everyone of course you eat normal food and but you need you need you need to think this and some of the food, some if you don't eat wide range of food, and some of the nutrition may not in the food, that may cause issues. And here just show you shows some example the nu nutrients for eye 
health. Uh, vitamin A, we know everyone that vitamin A is most important for the eye health. So, and um, but so in order to get vitamin A, you can eat liver, egg, carrot, and spinach and carrots. And so we all know this carrots is very important. And vitamin C that is not specific for for the eyes. So that may be easy. Most people we know may know this that uh, have more vitamin C. Just eat more fruits and the vegetables. That should be more should be the problem. And vitamin E is also very important for eye health. But that may be need pay attention. So you have some almonds and also sunflower seeds. Vegetables, and then this too important for the macula is a uh, lutein and then axin, and basically you need to eat lot of uh, leafed vegetables like spinach, carrot, parsley, and green beans peas, and this pro this product may not be very popular so you need to add this product in your food and also omega-3 and omega-6 and this fat acid is very important for the retinal and for the function of the eye so like you need to eat uh, every week you need to eat some kind of fish like oil fish like a tuna and salmon and also you need om omega-6 fat acid you need some kind of uh, flour oil and so this com this nutrients may not popular so you need to try to add some of this in and zinc and so zinc may in some case if you're not careful this may cause the defects yeah if you eat enough food I think you should have enough to nutrition for your eye health and I think if you feel that your nut nutrients is not enough I suggest you eat some supplement for example I eat uh, central vitamin is com complex vitamin. They have enough vitamin A, vitamin C, vitamin E, lutein, and zinc, and so to cover all most of the components. Then I also eat fish oil to provide omega three fat acid or omega six fat acid. Yeah, I will going to list this. Uh, complex complex vitamin and also omega in in this description and so you know where to looking for them just give you some kind of uh, easy way to find them so you have kind of a reference yeah that's a uh, uh, new this is a nutrition for eye health I think I think it's very important you need everyone need to pay attention and because all this sum of nutrition is, is really eye specific. If you don't add to to your food, and that's may cause trouble for your eye. And also all this like products, most of vitamin A, C, E, lutein, the axin, or omic three fat acid, I think. And this, all this product cannot produce, cannot generate by the human body. You need, you must supply it. Supply, otherwise they are going to have defect, have uh, cause you eye problem. And that's the talk for the day. I wish to see you in my next video. Bye.